All right, I'm gonna give you some tips on eight, or day seven, day seven here. Um, number one, some of the stuff that you guys are procrastinating on is stuff that you wanna do and you love. The stuff that brings you pleasure, right? That you think, that you think is, is, is important. Like you're, maybe you're a writer or you wanna do your art or you wanna dance more or cleaning out closets. You want your house more organized and you're procrastinating. And this doesn't mean that you're never gonna get these things done. Okay, it just means that right now there's something else that's more important. And so I'm, you know, you, this can be an emotional thing. If you if you're thinking of it as giving something up, it can become emotions. Emotion is not your IGS. If you're getting emotions, a negative emotion, that is a chemical interaction that is going in your mind is giving you a chemical interaction to a story you're running that's not true. A story that's 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 running, and you're giving an emo negative emotional reaction to it. It's not true. You'll often be closed because what you're thinking is not true. Your emotions are like a drug. Seriously, they're like a chemical interaction. They're like alcohol or sugar or tobacco or, you know, you know, marijuana. Right? They're a drug in your body. And so what happens is, is you run a story. You have a, a, a emotional reaction to it from old belief system that doesn't exist anymore about what it means for you, then the chemical interaction happens. And here's the interesting thing. That chemical interaction, just like alcohol in your system or, or sugar in your system, takes a while for it to go away. So you could solve the situation and the emotional feelings will still be there because it has to. the chemicals have to run through your body. But in the midst of an emotional experience, you can still feel the opening and closing. There's no hangover effect with your IGS. You can, you can, if you have an opening thought that's big enough in a situation where you've been closed, you open, that's it. There's no chemical interaction. This is not your emotions. I, I, there's a, there's a, a system out there that says your emotions are your guidance and it's not, it's not, you're going to get in trouble. So you can be angry and open because what you're thinking is true. And a lot of amazing change, like th people like Gandhi and Martin Luther King used opening anger to create change. You can be angry and closed because what you're thinking is not true. You can be feeling feelings of love, the staticness, and be open because what you're thinking about the person, they're the one, I love them, they're amazing, this is a great relationship for me. Open, open, open. And then you can also have a situation where you're thinking that and you're closed. You feel sick inside. You're, you're feeling like you're attracted to someone and, and you feel sick inside. And you're closed because what you're thinking about this person being your soulmate or the one is not true. Do you see how this works? So you want to make sure that you're not getting hung up. Now, I can't go through emotions in this program. That they're too, they take a long time to reprogram. And I don't mean that it's hard. It just takes time. And so uh, we do that in the Stress to Happiness Makeover program. Okay, so in the Stress to Happiness Makeover program, it's 12 weeks. I have time to work with you. There's nothing more powerful than having your emotions be aligned and open. Because opening begets opening. So if you're in an emotional experience and you're open, people listen. Things change. Magic happens. Okay? So, so just know that. And don't be upset about your things that you're procrastinating on. It doesn't mean you're never going to do those things. It just means that for now, you can relax in that energy of have to and have a way of sussing out why you're procrastinating and how to get back on track. Okay? All right, so keep commenting and giving us your questions. The mentors and the coaches and I are here, and we want to make sure that you get to the end of this game and you are full of energy and full of awareness about what this tool can do for you, this deep part of yourself. Enjoy your day. Bye. Thank you so much for doing the Recreating You game. I hope you're having extraordinary ahas already. People have from day one. And so no matter where you are in the game, there's amazing things that you're learning about yourself and the power that lies within you. If you would like to have your questions answered, please put them in the comments below. We do our best to get back to comments or so does our, our members <laughs> and our students. They love to go ahead and, and support people in learning to use their IGS. You are welcome to email us at support at smartsoul.com to get more deeply into the programs, or you can go to smartsoulacademy.com if you already know you want to jump in and learn how to master this extraordinary thing that you were born with, your internal guidance system. There you'll find 16 programs that lead you through all areas of your life and weekly group coaching with me so that we can work on your specific issues and supporting you and getting aligned with your purpose, your prosperity, and peace. That's smartsoulacademy.com, and it's all available to you for $25 a month. I know, amazing.
you can afford this less than Starbucks each week. Come check it out. SmartSoulAcademy.com.